She's a painter. It's her one woman show. Perfect. It's showtime! Ah, there's only four of you. Yes. The rest of the Arts Council are at a retreat. Well, just so you know, we will be incorporating a lot of improvisation in the piece. Oh, oh my God! Thank God you're here! I have been kidnapped. This woman is holding me hostage. You have to call the police. What are you looking at? What are you smiling about? Do you hear me? Call the police! Are you fucking deaf? My husband never listens. I guess it's hard to listen when you're incapable of shutting up about your lot in life. Oh my god. It's performance art. Look, I don't know what this little piece is about, and quite frankly, I don't give a shit! This is the truth. My name is Joe McCarthy. I'm getting married on Saturday. Joe! Darling! That Saturday was a long time ago. Besides, what you might have done doesn't matter. It's what you have done that counts. Anyway, you call 555-7321 and you ask for Rob Fitzgerald, okay? Or you call the police at 911 for go! Woo! Yes, that's right, you call 911. You tell them all right, of all the things you've collected to protect all right, yourself. All right, all right. Sunscreen, life insurance, Job security, a steady flow of booze to paint a rosy hue on that ghastly reality that is your life. <gasps> and let's not forget the hobby that keeps you from the dastardly vaginal fangs of the little woman. <laughs> she, she, she tricked me. I thought she was a stripper. And I thought we'd be happy. She drugged me! People have to help me get me out of here! <gasps> Wake up, darling. Can't you see there's no escape? You are fucking with my life. Why are you doing this to me? You made a decision. You wanted to be here, and you have a responsibility to that decision. I did not want to be here. That's not necessarily true. I wanted a normal life! I allowed you all the normal pleasures. Flirting with your secretary, homoerotic fantasies as you watched your precious football. I even sent our little children more and more wearing your befuddled expression to school every morning. The poor little dears. And with these hands, I prepared the starch and carbohydrates that is the inner tube around your gut. Da, 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 da. Why don't you stop talking about my gut and start talking about your heart? Hmm? Stop with the trendy psychobabble and give us something from your soul. Oh, all right, Mr. Demolition Parking Lot King will now hold forth on matters of the heart and soul. Uh, but that wouldn't fit here, would it? No, no, no room for heart and soul here. Why not? Because your gig is setting people up who you don't think are quite as hip as you are and then trashing them and all their values. Wow. Wow, isn't that original? But what does that leave you with? What does that leave her with? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nothing but a closet full of black clothes. What do you know about me? I know that your prison is as real as this chain and that mine. Well, at least I live in the world of my own making. You can't even create your own hell. You had to inherit it. And I am part and parcel of your misery. That's not as true as you think. But it's true enough, and for that part, I'm sorry. So now it's over. It's dead. Let me go. No way. 
Jose. There's a price to pay for what you did, and by God, you're gonna pay it! Fine, I'll pay it! I will pay! Call the lawyers! Call them all! I'll give you the house, the kids, the car, my clothes! Thank you. Thank you very much. Please. It's usually bigger. Thanks. So, Bill, Michelle, it was great. The ball and chain, the good ship compromise. I love the way you explore the dynamic of the human condition. Yeah. Get an application in. Thank you. The last time I saw Joe McCarthy, he was with the discipline bus. How did you get him to do this? Gunpoint. Get some papers to us next week. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Bye now. Be careful up those stairs. They loved me.